<laughs> and these people over here start standing up. You see us over here. <laughs> it's good now. And like, You're going to see a lot of this. This is going to last for about three minutes. Cavs have missed their last six shots and now trail by four. Brown all the way to the 10, making it look easy. Just a better fit Big time. for his skill set. Lavert ball fake on a three, takes it in. Inside! The throwdown for Jared Allen and the foul. And so their ability to spread the floor with the shooting now, something they really lacked a season ago. Ooh. Down goes Howard. To get open. 23-15 Celtics. Allen, good position. Ooh, if you're Cleveland. Point guard Craig Porter Jr. is in. The jumper goes. It's a three. Niang doesn't take the three. Instead, penetrates. Avert. The back end. The turnaround. It's good. Boston is six of 13 from three-point territory. Tatum over Porter. Beats the buzzer. Jason Tatum. He's a triple. And Mobley taps the ball to himself. Yeah, that was actually one of the better defensive possessions for Cleveland. Kept the ball in front of him. And then they get rewarded with a triple in transition from the Burke. Trying to take Niang off the dribble. Niang loses his balance. Open look. Holiday. In, out, and in for Drew Holiday. From During this 11-game winning streak, he said the preparation has been through the roof. The attention to detail. Cavaliers get that bucket to cash in. Sizing up Niang. Here's Cornette. Runs into Niang. Extra to Tatum. Nice vision from Cornette. They now lead by 10. Okoro back in. Takes it at Cornette. High off the window. Doesn't go. Allen is there. Loose change for Jared Allen. White gives it up. Catch and fire. Doesn't go. Hauser, offensive board, and Hauser is there after Brown comes away with 100%. And that's the vibe you get. Anybody you talk to associated with the Boston Celtics. No look. Jared Allen stuffs it down off the blind feed from Garland. Yeah, be right. There have not been a lot of whistles here in this first half. White upstairs. The crank from Porzingis. Jared Allen is now 6 of 11 from the field. He's got 13.7 rebounds. Tatum is going off. 22 points, 9 boards. Short pop for Jalen Brown. So Boston's lead is now 14. Two for one opportunity. The fadeaway, Darius Garland. Nylon. They're going to need him to find his rhythm offensively in the second half. Boston finished with six blocks in the first half. Lead by 10. Mobley still looking for his first points. And they come on the opening possession of the second half. Fifth of seven straight games against teams over 500. So they're doing it against legitimate competition. And keep in mind, they, they played Denver Thursday. So <laughs> Garland cans a triple against this Celtics defense. It's going to be hard for him to get opportunities. There was a good one, just couldn't convert. Stop and go by White. Holiday. He's going to take it over Merrill. Connects. On a break opportunity here for Boston. Brown looking for the trailer. Porzingis shovels. And he finishes. On Sunday, they led by 44 at halftime. Skimmer on a low pass. And it bounces off the hands of Merrill. Brown. Oh, he went for the big finish. He got denied by the rim, but the follow goes for Jalen Brown. Yeah, Lead is double figures. They can add to it. Currently an 11-point cushion. Tatum coughs it up. Mobley on the run. Give it up. Okoro running. Back for Mobley. Cutter. Allen. And oh! Oh, throw down! A terrific job of being patient there by Mobley. Not going for the pump fake. Mobley slams it down. Off the feed from Garland. 69-62, Celtics. Jump shot. Got him! Darius Garland. And one thing I love about... By Hauser. Merrill on a handoff for Levert. Four minutes to go in the third. Levert shovels. Allen rocks the rim! What we talked about in that first half, right? Forcing that aggression of the Celtics defense against them. Brown, left hand, 
You know he likes that. Cavs are shooting 56% in the third quarter. Levert walking the tightrope turnover. It rolled off the leg of Allen. White crosses, spins, loses his footing. Oh, excuse me! The basket goes in! It's all the stuff you're teaching with your G League squad. Carries over. Yeah, it's it, it almost like player development, right? Sure. Horford cans a triple. White bounces, Porzingis. Drive, jump off, easy one for Horford. And the crowd wanted to travel, but I thought that was a good no call. Niang comes over to help defensively. Brown, jumper, going and a foul! A chance for four! And I also like the fact that they reversed their call because that contact had no bearing on the play and it was marginal. Garland spins it in with point two. So the Cavaliers get points at the end of this third quarter. Pritchard protects, tosses it up, Cornette slams it down on the pretty feed from Pritchard. That was physical. The officials are allowing the players to play a little bit more. Horford, short. Wade couldn't grab it. Pritchard does lay up, rolls down for Peyton Pritchard. Both teams have been called for just nine fouls, so fast-paced one here in Cleveland, much to the liking of the Celtics. And another second-chance opportunity. It's Jason Tatum with the deuce. This offseason, Yang has been terrific. Max Struess, who's obviously also not playing tonight as well. And so I, I do think that this group, literally, that you're going to get through to the next round. Wade bangs in a triple. Left those shoes he had on tonight. Oh, uh, the red, the red Jordan. Yeah, those are. Oh shoes. yeah, he knows that oh, you can absolutely. see the shoes. He's, uh, he's very aware. His feet out. Niang drops in a three. Too big for Horford down low. Cut Wade. The stop. Levert bullet feeds Garland kick. Wade is he feeling it? Oh yeah. 25 to go. Wade for Niang. Got a three! Tie game! Screen. Garland uses it. Garland goes behind the back. Jared Allen on a kick. Wade. Splash! Five of their last six at home against the Celtics. We are down to a minute 42 to play. Porzingis back door to Holiday. So well done. To set a screen, go up top. Allen couldn't grab it. And it's handled by White. Celtics are on the move. They're down by two. Porzingis, the long strides, layup. Good and a foul. Levert, 10 to shoot. Now it's Garland. Drive to the rim. Left hand, no. It's Dean Wade coming out of nowhere. Seven seconds left. Tatum. Down to four seconds, three seconds. Tatum fades. It is no good. And a foul called with point seven. After review, the leg kick by the right leg of Tatum was deemed to make contact with Garland, where otherwise contact would not have happened. Therefore, the ruling on the floor is overturned. It's not enough for an offensive foul on Tatum as it didn't take time. By the Boston Celtics, they got very stagnant. And there was no movement, and it really allowed a, an undermanned Cavs team to be able to defend them. Boston will use a timeout. They controlled the jump ball and had a plan in place to call a timeout. They didn't have enough time.